Let's write the graph when we have slope of two and a y-intercept of one. And we'll also write the equation out for slope two, y equals intercept of one. So to start off, let's just look at the y-intercept here. We said the y-intercept is one. And what that means is if we go to the y-axis here and we find one, that's where the line is gonna cross the y-axis. So we have our first point here. For the slope, we have two, but it's helpful to think about that as two over one, rise over run, because then we can just go back to our y-intercept we just put here, rise one, two, and run one. We have two points. From there, we rise one, two, we go over one. You can see three points. We could just keep doing that one, two over one. And we can even go in the opposite direction, down one, two, and over the left one. Let's put a line through that. And we'll put arrows to show that the line goes to infinity. And that's the graph when we have a slope of two and a y-intercept of one. If we want to write the actual equation, the linear equation for slope two, y-intercept one, we could use slope-intercept form. Y equals m, that's the slope we said was two, and then we put x plus the y-intercept, we said that was one, and there's the equation for when we have slope two and y-intercept one. This is Dr. B.